How is glucose broken down in cells to produce energy for cellular activities? So there are a few pathways or methods. Start with the glucose in the cells, C6H12O6. Through the process of glycolysis, which is the breakdown of glucose in the cytoplasm, pyruvate molecules are formed. Pyruvate has uh, three carbon atoms each, all right? but we do not need to memorize this formula. Next, the pyruvate can either undergo fermentation or aerobic respiration, continue with aerobic respiration, depending on whether oxygen is present or not. If oxygen is present in the cell, then aerobic respiration continues. So the pyruvate will be moved into the mitochondria, an important organelle for aerobic respiration, and it's oxidized or broken down the mitochondria to produce the final products of water, carbon dioxide, and energy. The equation for aerobic respiration, the general equation is GOWEC, G for glucose, O for oxygen. These are the substrates. And then the products are W for water, E for energy, and C for carbon dioxide. This process occurs in most organisms. Right? So aerobic respiration can be defined as the complete breakdown of glucose huh, into water and carbon dioxide in the presence of oxygen to produce chemical energy. The main aim is to produce chemical energy stored in ATP for cellular activities. Next, the pyruvate can also undergo fermentation uh, when there is no oxygen present or there's a limited amount of oxygen, right? So fermentation is a different pathway from aerobic respiration. Now, in fermentation, the pyruvate undergoes the breakdown in the cytoplasm, not in the mitochondria, okay? So fermentation occurs in the cytoplasm. There are two types of fermentation. Alcohol fermentation and lactic acid fermentation. Alcohol fermentation occurs in yeast and in plants that are in the waterlogged soil. In alcohol fermentation, the pyruvate is broken down to produce the final products of ethanol, a type of alcohol, and carbon dioxide with the production of energy. Whereas in lactic acid fermentation, this process occurs in bacteria and in the skeletal muscle cells of humans that are undergoing vigorous activity. So, in lactic acid fermentation, pyruvate is broken down to form lactic acid with the production of energy, right? So, energy is not mentioned here, but energy is produced. Now, here we can see that ethanol and lactic acid can be actually broken down further. So, actually, the glucose is incompletely broken down. Fermentation is defined as the incomplete breakdown of glucose in conditions of limited oxygen or conditions that have no oxygen, without oxygen, to produce chemical energy.